I updated my OBS version. So hopefully, whatever the hell kept happening, because for anyone who wasn't here on Wednesday, I tried to play Crisis Core as planned um, after putting some uh, packaging up the, the six hour game jam game and whatnot. And uh, I, I pushed that out and then I hopped on to try to play some Crisis Core. And within the first 45 minutes of the stream, the stream went down twice. No idea why. I don't know if Twitch and or OBS just hate Crisis Core or if Twitch was having issues that day or what, but it's happened like four or five times in the past couple of weeks to us. Um, so I like, I decided to just stop the stream there. I updated OBS and everything. I'm hoping that fixes the issue because uh, I really want to get through whatchamacallit one of these days crisis score i i really like the game don't get me wrong but i'm ready to play some other stuff there's so many games i want to play my guy and that's hard to do when um when things want to crash on us or not crash but like not work for us uh, it's gonna bug me that these like three here aren't being done so allow those three okay so this is the mech gestator this is the sub core encoder I'm glad we're getting this stuff, but like, don't get me wrong, um, but we can't actually use it yet <laughs> because we got to get a mechanator apparently. I remember doing a little bit of reading off a of stream last, uh, two weeks ago, I guess it was actually, and apparently to get a mechanator, if you don't spawn with one, what you got to do is... Um, this group of, like, ancient mech ship stuff, wherever it's at, there should be... Oh, no. Oh, there it is. Okay. Right here. Who's starving? Mr. Noodle starving? Eat some food, you dude. Anyways. Um, <laughs> apparently what we gotta do is we gotta wake up the ship, murder everybody that's in there, and then we're gonna be raided, and we need to deal with that raid too, I think is what it said. Uh, and then we can start getting robots to work for us, which is going to be fun. I'm pretty happy about that. Pretty excited about that, to be honest. You're busy doing schoolwork. I feel it, man. No problem. Smeargle. The thing with a paintbrush? Yeah. It was pretty cool looking. It was the, uh, like, the full art one or whatever. Like, yeah. You found Voyager again? Wait, what? I... You found Voyager again? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Star Trek Voyager. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. I was confused about what you were talking about. <laughs> I was I was very confused, my guy. But okay, I got you now. I got you. Um I mean whatever, that's fine. I don't care. Alright, anyways, you have to go to bed soon. I gotcha. Thank you for coming and saying hello, at least, Drew. I appreciate you. Paramount Plus has Voyager. Ah, I gotcha. Noodle and I need to take a look at uh, Paramount Plus because we uh we have a Paramount we have the cheap tier of it, but we have Paramount Plus, but we never really uh never really sat down and looked at all the different options on it there. We looked at a couple of them, I'm pretty sure, but I'm positive there's a lot more. Oh no. Well, this ain't good. We're getting errors. That usually means that we need to fix the file. Some file either got corrupted or a mod corrupted a file somewhere. Hopefully it doesn't affect the entire save too bad, like going forward. Um, all these quests that have already spawned seem okay. We'll see how that goes in the future though. After we get off, I'll have to try and remember to, ooh, to uh, verify all the files. This doesn't look too bad. We got what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight fennec foxes coming to murder us up. Do we have any friendlies in the area that we can just let deal with it? No. Okay. I was thinking one of the things we're going to do to help with these like animal raids and whatnot. I think we're going to build a big old wall. Like from here down to here. And then like give us some extra space. But just, just a massive wall. And then like from here down this way all the way over. And then, like, maybe from the corner of this down or something like that. That way, like, we have somewhere to hide. And we can set up a kill box for the, uh, 
weird the the once in a lifetime raids that we'll <laughs> get from accepting quests or whatever uh and it'll help deal with the robots whenever they come and try to murder us up all right well noodle doesn't have a weapon so i feel like that's important we should at least get you a weapon of some sort uh is there anything good weapon wise um not particularly huh okay well, Noodle, can we... Maybe I can't force you to sit it down, to sit the baby down because you're not currently drafted? There we go. Go put Lulu away. Rue is using a club. Uh, I feel like we have a better weapon than a club around here somewhere. What happened to all of our weapons? <laughs> well, I know we had some decent weapons laying around somewhere. Did I accidentally sell them off or something? I don't know. But okay, let's do that. Uh, we'll grab everybody else. Get you guys drafted and lined up just over here. Where are the Fennec Fox? Okay, they're coming from there. So actually, get you lined up like this-ish. Kind of like that hate when Nickelodeon or Netflix get, why do you hate when Nickelodeon gets Netflix shows why is that like worse than like when somebody else gets them yeah you got the baby put away good I guess the machine pistol and then when you're done with that come over here Chocobo's running awfully slow. I mean, Chocobo, I'm pretty sure, is high right now. So, like, that's probably part of the problem. I wish all of our people weren't, like, shooting at our people. <laughs> but... Oh, God. Now that machine pistol... Okay, can we, like, run away and kite? Colonist needs rescue. Oh, no. Oh, it's Nate. Don't let Nate die. <laughs> Not again. Okay. I think that's good. Search and destroy. Okay, you're not going anywhere. So everybody must be good. Undraft. Somebody save Nate. How bad is he? Uh, Death in five hours. So he's probably going to be fine. As long as he doesn't get an infection or anything too bad. Should be okay. Just need to remember to give him his weapon back. Like... Oh, that's true, Noodle. Yeah, Netflix does only get, like, half the series at a time, which is dumb and annoying. Like, uh, okay, Noodle? Breastfeeding Lulu. Yeah, I'm sure that's important and all, but can you, like, take care of Nate first? Oh, I forgot Otto's a doctor, too. I guess we could have let Otto do it. Uh, it's fine. He's just gonna die in three hours. Can you get over there, please? <laughs> Jesus, my guy. Okay, he's gonna be—he's getting cared for now. He should be fine. Yeah. Wait, cheerfully making fun of her? What? Did that say Otto tried to woo you by cheerfully making fun of your pubic hair? <laughs> I—I'm not positive that's what that said, but I think that's what it said. <laughs> Which is a message I've definitely never seen in the game before. Uh, <laughs> Nate has a medical emergency. He'll be fine. He's been treated. Um, Auto, clean up some blood. And then, yeah. There you go. So is it the just the name of our colony that's the error? That might be what the error is. Raw chicken clothes finally in the washer? Gross. Nate, why are you up and moving, my guy? You, that's how you get infections. Um, bed rest. Nate, you're like by far the worst off of everybody. So like, look, I'm, I'm glad you're getting your psych IT and all that, my guy. But maybe go lay down before you pass the fuck out, dude. Because that's what's going to end up happening. Now what are you doing? Why are you washing? I mean, I guess washing is probably good for disease risk. But like... 
Go lay down before you die. All right, Chocobo's back up and running. How's Rue doing? You were injured, but not too bad, right? Yeah, you're fine. Just a couple small. Couple small bites. You're going to be fine. A war merchant? Uh, honestly, I don't think we have anything to really sell. Maybe some shitty clothes. Will you buy shitty clothes? What is this? Oh, oh I forgot we got that Psychite Sooth Pulsar thingy. We got some sculptures. I don't think they'll buy sculptures. Who's our talker these days? We got... I'm blind. Where's Warden? Off to Jack. Oh, God, yeah. This is going to be annoying. Everybody's name is Error. <laughs> Why, though? There must have been an update or something that broke some stuff. It's annoying. Okay. We're kind of short on herbal meds. I wouldn't mind buying some of those. Um, we could sell the steel club that's about to break and the wooden club. Psychic Sooth Pulsar is worth a lot, but could also come in handy. Flame bow with a load of incendiary arrows. Ooh. Uh, that sounds like a good way to catch the world on fire, though. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna skip on that. But sounds cool though. Uh, kid rompers. We're probably gonna need that cloth robe. We can probably get rid of those. Kid clothes keep. Cloth t-shirts fine. Kid parka. Devil Strand Park is kind of nice. We'll keep that. You will buy statues, too. How much money do you have? A fair bit. There you go. Take all the sculptures. Except. Right, Hello. Howdy, Chocobo. Hey. Thank you for the resub, too, my guy. Let me uh, throw those on now because I know I will forget if I don't. For the, the resub ones, at least. Psycho, what's up? Hello, hello, dude. Um, games to complete, Final Fantasy X. It's only sitting at a solid uh, 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 122 votes. <laughs> There's a pretty decent chance I feel like that's going to end up being the one whenever we roll. It's uh, hard to say for sure, but I feel like probably, my guy. Shit, where's my drink at? It's kind of hard to hydrate without a drink. There it is. I got it. Not much left, but some. Was that a times 25 or just a regular, your first vote? Just one, okay. Mm. Thank you for the reminder. I've, uh, I haven't, I don't think I've really drank enough today, to be completely honest with you. Normally, when I'm at work, I buy a couple liters of, uh, stuff to drink, but, like, today I, uh, I, I had, I accidentally forgot one from a previous day at work, so I just drank that one throughout the day. So I didn't have as much liquid in general as I normally do. What's Metal Gear Solid 3 at? It is sitting at, it's up there. It's not that high, but it's up there. It's sitting at a cool 89, which I think puts it in second place. Yeah, puts it in second place. The next closest is Mortal Kombat Shaolin Monks with 82. Um, and then after that, we don't have anything over 70. God of War is getting close, but not quite. Not quite there. All right, a Muffalo self-tamed. That sounds like meat, because I'm pretty sure Muffalo don't give milk anymore. If they still gave milk, I might have kept one around for that. But uh, I'm pretty sure these days they, they're they basically useless. So, Okay, what's our uh, power sitting at? Because we're in the day. Everything's running. Grid excess zero? Really? Wait, are you not hooked up to the power? This one must not be hooked to power. How did that happen? Oh, wow, okay. Yeah, I just don't have a power line going over there. Well, let's get, it's kind of useless to have a battery that's not hooked to power, so let's get you hooked up real quick. Is Resident Evil 4 still alive? Yes, it has... 
Resident Evil 4 is sitting at... Oh, no. Sitting at zero votes. I thought... I thought it had some votes. But... Not sitting at zero. That's definitely what it says. Huh. I mean... Oh, the chicken. <laughs> I thought you were talking about the game. There's so many of them now. Uh, probably not, though, because we've been offing a bunch of them. We got Kebab. We got Heifer. Teriyaki. Cross the Road. Hennifer. Stir Fry Nugget. Uh, stuffing. Gobbles. I don't think... <laughs> If anybody wants to name chickens, by all means, just know that they're probably going to be murdered at some point. <laughs> like this buffalo. I mean, we do get buffalo fur from them. But, like, we also eat twice as much nutrition as what we actually have in here. So that's a bit of an issue. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, berry bushes, grass, gray grass. Wow, toxin adapted grass. Now we can cut that. We don't need we don't need toxin grass, toxic grass. Speaking of, this is kind of gross over here. Oh, uh Nate, how you doing, man? Are you mostly healed at this point? No. Not really. Okay. Well, I was going to give him his weapon back, but I guess if he's still kind of you know, not doing so well, probably not the best idea. Should we start building our walls? How's our construction? Actually, not all that bad. I don't see anything around that really needs construction work done. Um, besides some power conduits, which would be awfully nice to get put up, honestly. We got Rue, Nate, Optijack. Optijack's the main one. What's he doing? Cleaning dirt. Oh, I must have had, like, cleaning on a high priority for everyone. No. Are we out of steel? We're probably out of steel. That's the problem. You're going to go ahead and head out. Sorry, guys. No, no problem, man. If you're tired, get some rest, dude. 100%. I understand that, man. Oh, that's weird. Sam has a normal name. Why is everyone else error but Sam? <laughs> I love that message there. The little pop-up. Just error, error. Nice. Hopefully uh, verifying the files here will we'll fix it up. Bucky. I think you meant okay. <laughs> oh, wait. Oh. I just now saw a noodles message sorry were you wanting to name one of the chickens a bucky or something that came out of nowhere the bucky message hogwarts legacy is beautiful it is a very pretty game uh missing steel we should have some flagged the problem is nate is our main miner so, so with him down and out we're missing our main cook and miner which, actually, we should probably get a secondary cook going for the time being. Uh, which is probably going to have to be auto for now. Just because we are running very low on food all of a sudden. Sucks nobody else has passion for it. And since Optijack's not doing any real work at the moment, I guess we can go ahead and start building our walls. Uh, so probably from this edge here. Kind of annoyed that I got to do it like that, but whatever. And then from there, close that off. Oh, God. Mad alpacas. Why? <laughs> of course. <laughs> Who made the alpacas mad? Uh, you're going to have to build a bridge, too. Ugh, gross, dude. I mean, I guess we can't really get around it. If that's the case, though, we might as well go up a row. Like, just go there. Make it as small as possible. Actually, we can make it even... Oh, you piece of crap. I guess we can do it like that. 
But then we're going to mine all that out. Son of a bitch. <laughs> this is super annoying. Okay. Cancel that. Cancel all of that and that. There we go. That'll that'll be good enough. You said to name chickens? You're allowed to name chickens. I just said that like 20 minutes ago, love. Okay. Where's the chicken? Uh, we have so many chicks that the chicks are starting to be killed off. <laughs> I feel bad. Like, I want the chicks to grow up before we kill them, but we can't have 10 million of them roaming around either. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, where is a... Uh... Do we have any full-grown chickens that aren't named? Doesn't look like it. Stir fry across the road. So we're just going to pick a uh, number 27 here. You look cool. <laughs> Your name is now Bucky. There you go, man. How about the muffalo? I'm not going to kill the muffalo right away. So we could maybe. Oh. Good. We're getting all kinds of errors. Fun. Oh, they're all mad. Why are they all mad, dude? I thought whenever they went to sleep, they were automatically like, oh, it just didn't trigger yet. Uh, Okay, so we need to grab everybody again, except for Nate. Draft. Get you guys out here, because apparently we got to hunt some alpaca. Oh, Noodle, why with the baby? <laughs> Always with the baby. Oh, shit, no, not everybody. I want most of you guys to stay where you're at. I just want Noodle. Noodle, go put the baby away. <laughs> the alpaca aren't going to break into the room. Otto, what are you? No, Otto, stay out here. God, we're all going to die, and it's going to be Noodle's fault. All right, Rue and Chocobo. Uh, Chocobo, Chocobo, Chocobo. There you are. I need you two to come down here. Just keep kiting these guys. Okay, this one's attacking Optijack, so get him. Good, good, good. Get the other one. Nice, nice, dudes. Okay. Undraft everyone. Finish off and finish off. Wait a second. Noodle and the baby! <laughs> I didn't realize one of them went after Noodle and the baby. All right. Uh, son of a bitch. No, everybody except for Nate. Draft, attack. Okay, there we go. Draft and undraft. There we go. Both have finish off commands. Okay. Noodle, how bad are you? Oh, good. You got some... A crushed heart? Holy shit, dude. <laughs> that, that doesn't seem good, my guy. Uh, <laughs> sorry about your heart, dude. Uh, Otto's fine, at least, though, right? So Otto can doctor for us still. I realize that it's not, like, life-threatening having a crushed heart or whatever. But I still feel like you should get that checked real quick. You just have a single bruise and you just have a single bruise. Wait, your left arm was cut off? We must have did that at some point. A constructor missing a left arm. That's good. Oh, that's right. We were putting up walls. Okay. Structures. More walls. And then from like... Is this a straight line from there? It is. I don't know. Like... We want to leave at least, like, 13, right? Three. One, two, three. It's, like, down to here-ish. And then... Maybe from this corner here. God, this is a big-ass wall, dude. <laughs> that is massive, my guy. Cancel those. And we definitely want some doors around here door 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 just doors everywhere uh short door there door here 
here, here, and here. There we go. No particular layout to it, just throw them down. Oh, and then we're going to need a kill box. And in order for a kill box really to work, you need either a hole in the wall or something like that. So we'll put that there. Then I'm not going to do anything fancy for now. I'm just going to have a literal box with some sandbags. Uh, security. Sandbags. All along here. And then... Yeah, I'm going to make it not, like, fancy, but a little bit more than this. Uh, hold on. There we go. Something like that. And the security spike traps made of wood. Um, cannot be. Oh, you can't put traps diagonally from each other anymore. Oh, weird. I know that there's tricks you can do to get these laid out here much more densely. Um. I'm not going to worry about that, though. Because our only real raids are going to be from, like, animals and occasionally from the whatchamacallits. The, like, mechs or whatever. So just something like that. Nah, cancel that one. I do want a fence post or something here, though. I don't think fence posts cut them off from being in here. Hmm. May or may not have just went through some hoops so you could get it without having to pay full amount for it today. <laughs> nice. I don't want them using this as cover. Maybe, there we go, that's what we'll do. We'll put a fence post here. I mean, I guess they could still use a cover to like shoot down that way. I don't know, whatever, it's fun. Tis what it is. That'll at least give us a lot more defense than what we had, right? Not perfect by any means, but it's something. Where's our home zone button? Oh, you know what? It's under zones. Duh. I must have that turned off. Which, honestly, that's fine. Oh, it's as he builds it. Okay, well, whatever, then that's fine. Your hands were dirty. You better be okay. And did you answer my question? Uh, you said the name Chickens. Legacy is beautiful. Ooh, have a nice night, Bucky. Oh, strawberries and a kiwi or just a kiwi? Uh, I wouldn't mind a couple strawberries. I don't want too many, but I also don't want them to go bad. So I think a couple strawberries and then just throwing a whole kiwi down in there or whatever. Sounds good. Klarna to get gift cards, then use gift cards to get Steam gift cards. Nice. <laughs> That's one way to do it, I suppose. I mean, hey, what's important is you got it, right? And getting it for free is always nice. I want to pop this, but I know as soon as we do, we're, we're dead. Oh, uh, another thing that I wanted to announce, this will probably be the last stream of or not the last stream but the last series of RimWorld for a little while um i don't know we might try out like door fortress or something or we might just switch it up i still want to do the strategy games with my brother it's not the most popular thing for me to stream on twitch by far but i have a ton of fun with it so screw it <laughs> um but we might switch it up we might try something else instead like uh I don't know. I was thinking of maybe doing Bethesda games, maybe uh, Nintendo games. Haven't quite decided yet, but uh, yeah, we're going to switch it up a little bit. Do something else, but we're going to finish up this series first, so that won't be for a little while. We got mad guinea pigs now. All these animals be going crazy. Oh, it's literally just one. Okay. Chocobo. 
if you get your ass kicked by a guinea pig, then honestly, that's on you, dude. Come beat up this guinea pig before it, like, murders someone. Good job. You got two scratches. Well, <laughs> let's hope they don't get infected. Also, let's unforbid everything, because there's a bunch of random junk all over the place, so... Might as well unforbid it. Noise, noise, noise. Okay. We can go back to... Probably not dev speed, but... Super speed and fast speed. It wasn't free, but you just got to pack lunch, keep it cheap, or use points for a free sandwich and get only two energy drinks and it equals out. Or, crazy idea, you could skip the energy drinks for a little while. That would save you a lot of money right there. I was literally just thinking, man, we should have Nate mine a couple things, even though he's healing, so that we can get this uh, power line up to charge this battery. Doesn't freaking matter now, though. <laughs> Uh, solar flare, dude. Knocked everything the hell out. Oh, well. It's not that big of a deal. Once we have the walls up, what we could do... Nah, because I don't want to mean my crops, actually. We could put a fence just around our crops, and then we could just let the animals roam free. Thank you for playing music on all speakers there, Mr. Noodle. I, <laughs> I appreciate that. Are you saving the gross broccoli stalks? Uh, I mean, I like the broccoli stalks, so I would appreciate if you didn't just throw them away. Like, yes, music did start playing up here. <laughs> I'm assuming you didn't hear me, but... Otto tried to woo Nate A by joking about seduction. Nate A responded well and is now Otto's lover. Nice, dude. You guys got a room together? You do? And Mr. Noodle's healed now. Nice. Oh, you bumped it? Okay. You're sorry? It's okay. It's not that big of a deal. She's gone without them enough times lately, and it's terrible. It's not even a matter of the lack of caffeine. They're also the main thing I drink with a fruity taste anymore. There's a lot cheaper options out there with fruity taste, though, my guy. Like, if that's what you're after, you know? Like, those drinks that I drink, those are only 70-some cents for a liter. That's a lot cheaper than an energy drink is. Drink mix, like water drink mix, a lot cheaper. Just saying. It's a good way to save some money. Didn't like them? Well, then maybe you should just stop being so picky. <laughs> Beggars can't be choosers, my guy. All right, Nate, you're fully healed now, right? Good. Okay, well, you're butchering and cooking and stuff. That's fine. Get caught up on some of that, but what we really need you to do whenever you finally wake the hell up is uh, to get some mining done for us because yeah oh that's right this is going to be our rec room so we should probably I'll wait until the lights are put up but we're going to move the game of Ur down here since that's our rec room um, and to give people some different uh, stuff to do let's go ahead and throw down a poker table and a billiards table. Something like that. Probably want a couple chairs for the poker table. Furniture. Uh, this is going to make our colony worth more money, which means we're going to get attacked more. But I guess we're using stools. I don't see any regular chairs, just dining chairs and stools. There's armchairs. I mean, honestly, like, what kind of cloth do we have? We have a bunch of random leathers. How much does it take for an armchair? 110. Is that the same for, like, leather? It is. That sucks. What kind of... What is this? Camel hide? Hmm. I've, uh, sometimes I want to, like download a mod that just makes all the leather one kind but having the variety is nice like it's neat but it also makes things so much harder man uh 340 yeah no, I, th I think we just don't have the stuff for the armchairs so y'all are gonna sit on some stools
There you go. Deal with it. Oh no, these strawberries feel a little soft. I'm sorry. That's why you're trying to cut back in other areas. You know what that sounds like to me, my guy? Addiction. I'm just saying. <laughs> Whenever you're like, I need something so bad, I'm willing to give up everything else for it. And I have to buy it every day. That's called addiction. I'm just saying. That's all I'm throwing out there. You might have a problem whether you like it or not. Lulu became a child, dude. I knew it was going to happen soon. I didn't know when exactly. So baby Lulu has grown up and become a child. She is now old enough to do the following work. Patient, bed rest, child care, basic haul, and clean. We got a hauler. Okay, but, 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 okay. Since Lulu can walk around now, though, it's important that we keep her in a safe area. Um, I'm, there we go. Expand allowed areas. Manage new area. We're gonna call this children. Close. Expand. Uh, children. Okay, so children can come to any of the buildings that they want. That's fine. Uh oh, I was one short here. Uh, they can come chill by the fire and play hoops and whatnot. I, I suppose that's fine. The bathrooms should probably be around, allowed around the bathrooms. Uh, yeah, you can visit the graves. All of this stuff's fine. Do, 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 do. Okay. Uh, and then, like, all of this... That should be good enough for the children. I mean, I guess the stuff in the middle there, why not, right? That look good. Once we get the walls up, we'll probably let them anywhere within the walls. But right now, we just don't have enough walls to feel safe doing that. So let's follow Lulu around a little bit. What's your uh, work cycle set to automatically here? Okay, patient is going to be your number one priority, so then bed rest. Capture is going to be the absolute lowest priority. You shouldn't be capturing people. Actually, you know what? Just turn off capturing. <laughs> Hall plus, level one. Child care. Uh, level two, maybe. You can finish. You can murder things. Let's turn that off for you, too. <laughs> and then uh, basic, yeah. I, I guess just have... All oh, wait. Hall and clean. Okay, child care can be a three. Basic will be a one. Honestly, I think I'd rather have you like that. Actually, I guess if you're taking care of children, other like your mother doesn't have to do it as much, your mother or father. So maybe like that. Eh. Oh, you can manage. You can do colony management. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, by all means, if you want to manage the colony, have at it, my guy. Yeah, you know what? You can you can do child care before hauling. That's fine. There we go. So you're not going to capture things and you're not going to murder things. Uh, Lulu can remain a tribesman. We're not gonna, we're not gonna enslave them. You haven't made anywhere near as many stupid purchases lately. It's growth. You're doing good, my guy. Don't argue the fact that you have a caffeine addiction. The multi-brewed coffee is evidence of that. Very true. Very true. Anybody have ideas for muffalo names? Since uh, I'm gonna be keeping it for a little while. Lulu has gotten sick from a simple meal food poisoning. Oh, shit. We forgot to put Lulu in the safe zone. We made it, and then we never <laughs> put Lulu in it. Good job, us. Uh, yeah, that, that sleep schedule's fun. Do you get your own room now? How does that work? You do. Right across from your parents. That's nice. Um, are there any, like, children's toys or anything? Because, like, we have the toy box and stuff. Are these for, like, babies, though? 
Toy Box contains many small toys. Toy Box can be used to play with babies, satisfying their need to play. Yeah, so there doesn't seem to be any, like, toys for children, necessarily. Which sucks. Hmm. Well. Oh, well, I guess what we do need before winter comes around, it's September, so it's going to be coming soon. We need to get some uh, heaters. I'm hoping just one for each room will be enough. Or each set of rooms here will be enough. Uh, heater in here. People shouldn't be spending much time in there. They might be spending a fair amount of time in here, though. So let's throw one in there. And same with this here. Uh, yeah, sure. Right over there is fine. We need that steel, though. Nate, have you done any mining lately? You're making tea. Okay, we're, we're good on meals. That's good. We have a bunch of food for this winter. A bunch of food. <laughs> we might be growing a little bit too much, honestly, but I would rather have too much than not enough. Plus, we'll probably go through a fair amount of it in the winter. Uh, okay, you're making psychite tea. Uh... What's our tea supply look like? Not bad. Got some silver, got some wood. Quest active collection of valuables. Intercepted messages about a collection of valuable items worth $1,000 not far from Olympia. Compact weaponry. Two manhandling timber wolves are wandering nearby and there may be an unknown threat. I mean, the timber wolves aren't bad. The unknown threat could be bad though. Building mech recharger, kind of useless to us right now, to be honest. I'd rather you focus on the wall, but I mean, whatever. I'm still going to let it be done. Uh, what I am going to do, though, is turn off the power to all these things, because right now they're probably drawing a bunch of power that we don't need to be drawing. Do we have the electric stove? We do. Bad temperature? Oh, geez. Yeah, it's cold in there. I guess from the air conditioner leaking. From constantly, like, running in and out. Oh, that's right. It's building copy. Right there. For that. We're working on the temperature. Not much I can do about it at the moment, though. How you doing, Lulu? Cleaning dirt, cleaning trash, keeping it nice and clean in here. Oh, shit. Since we have a child, we also need a schoolroom now. Oh, God. Creolich, what's up, my guy? How you doing? I completely forgot about that. That's kind of important. Uh, okay. This is my first time doing the child care stuff. Where is... Is it under furniture? School desk. Um... How many kids do we need to build, like, a dedicated room for the school? For now, we can probably just throw them down, like, here somewhere, right? Two sets of desks should be enough. And then do we have a blackboard? We do. Maybe two sets of blackboards? Drapes, sun lamps. I don't think we need anything else for that. Okay. Optijack. Your sleep need is fine. Come work on this bench. Or not this bench, the school desk. So that we can start teaching Lulu things. Because while I haven't played or done, like, the children thing yet, I've watched somebody else do it. And I know that if you get them enough... Um, enough stuff, right? <laughs> They, uh, the children, whenever they do finally turn into, like, adults or throughout their childhood, you can pick what they specialize in if you get them enough points from, uh, while they're a child. From, from learning through, like, the, the school there or, uh, getting practice. Talking to people is a big thing on the comms, but we don't have comms. Can we get comms? Hmm. Doesn't look like it yet. Maybe that's something we should be researching then. 
Under microelectronics? It is. 6,000 tech. Holy crap, my guy. That's a lot for us. Oh my god. Okay, well. Start researching it. It's gonna take a little while. But we want Lulu to not be dumb, so <laughs> I, guess, I guess we don't have a whole lot of uh, a choice there. Chunk of spacecraft? Uh, deconstruct. That's steel. The walls are slowly coming up. Optijack's working on it. Oh, he's getting our stove. Nice. Having a nice electric stove. And that'll be two cook spots, so while Otto does technically suck at it, he uh, can still do it, which will be nice. Isn't there like a clones? Can we link these together? I thought there was a way to. That might be from a mod or something that I'm thinking of, though. Um, mint wheel. What the hell is mint wheel? Plants, research, main button, mint gear. Hmm. Sadly, that might not be a thing. Oh. Haste bill stack to table? Delete that one. He's supposed to... Hey! Okay. So it's not as nice, because, like, the mod that I, I was thinking of, it, uh... You could actually, like, link two together so that if I change the bills here, it would change them here. And it doesn't seem like that'll do that with this mod, but still, that's not bad. I'll take what I can get. Oh. Follow mods got me messed up. Are you playing with chalk? You are. That's cute. It's too bad Chocobo doesn't have more, like, usable skills. Because <laughs> they never sleep. So, like, it'd be really nice if they could cook or something. I mean, they're an awesome grower, right? And they're pretty good at art. But it'd be really cool if they could do other helpful stuff, like cook. Or build. <laughs> but he would be way too OP if he could. So I guess, I guess it's a good thing we don't have him set up that way. But I kind of wish we did at the same time. Okay, don't we have these set to like... Pause when satisfied, unpause it for you. Okay, we must have just happened to run out of them. But we're getting them twice as quick now, so that's good. Uh, you're set to 70. I don't know what the minimum, like, comfortable temperature is. I'm gonna set you to, like, 68. That'll save a little bit of power. And then the other thing that we did want to do in here, too, that I just now remembered. We wanted to get some fermenting stuff set up. This corner over here is going to be packed full of shit. Whatever. And some fermenting barrels. Does it give us information on what temperature range? It doesn't. Eh, well. I'm sure it's fine. You know what? I don't like this here. Build coffee. But you, sure, right there next to the heater. That's fine. And then fermenting barrels. Five of them should be plenty, I think. Sounds like you want to trap them in an area that only lets them practice those skills. The problem is in RimWorld, with the, the work system, if you don't have passion for something, you only gain experience for it at like 50% rate. Um, I can force them, even without trapping them in a room, I can force people to only work on what I want them to work on. Uh, so that's not the problem. The problem is just that it would take them forever to get any actual skill in that area. Because uh, they don't like doing it, right? They only do it because you make them do it, sort of deal. So that's the problem. Uh, if they had any passion in it at all, they would gain at least 
experience rate. But they don't. I mean, having somebody constantly collecting food for us is still a pretty big thing. Like, I'm surprised none of our animals have started to starve, considering, like, how much more food they eat than what we grow. But somehow they haven't, so... Who is our animal handler? Handle. Mr. Noodle and Otto, which... Both of you are set to do that as your highest work priority. So you're good. Okay. Visiting some graves. That's fine. Noodle. Drinking site tight tea. Murdering some chickens. Kind of surprised you're not uh, eating, to be honest with you. Eating and sleeping. That's what I expect Noodle to be doing at any given time. That's basically all they do. 24-7. Eat and sleep. Oh, God, man. <laughs> no, Otto. Otto's just going on a rampage over here, dude. Oh, God. This is a lot of meat. I don't think we're ever going to have to go hunting again, dude. <laughs> We get so much meat from the chickens. And then we have all these eggs, too. Like, you know what we can do to start using a little bit more of it since we do have so much food now? Go into the bills on this one. I won't worry about it on the fuel fueled stove. But at least on this nicer one, we can start making uh, fine and lavish meals. We're not going to, like, keep a ton of them around. We'll keep, like... Uh, for the fine meals, we'll keep like two around per person, or three. Three around per person. And we'll stop making them when we only have one per person. Two per person? One per person. We'll do two. Two per person. Uh, I, think I, I think I have it set so our people don't mind eating insect meat, I'm pretty sure. Uh, yeah, that all looks good. Okay, clothes and then lavish meals as well. We'll do not one per person. We'll do a X per person. Two. Not 11. Two, please. And details. Just eating better food just makes people happier. So we might as well, since we have the ingredients. Oh, wait. Do I have bulk versions of those? I do. Son of a bitch. Uh, okay. Do it again. Lavish meal times four and fine meal times four. Fine meal times four. Lavish meal times four. Can I just copy and... Oh, there is no paste? I thought there was a paste button. Well, shoot. Details. Same thing. X per person, four, pause, two, insect meat, not human meat. I don't think they'd like that too much. Oh, and then actually, because I almost forgot, we have to turn off panther meat too. We don't want another one of those debacles. We had a lot of very upset people for a while. Two per person, one. Turn off panther meat, turn on insect. There we go. Nice. That'll use up more of our ingredients than the basic meals and also make the colonists a little bit happier because they have better tasting food to eat with more variety. I'm assuming that's what Nate's making now. Yeah, four fine meals. The one annoying part about that, though, I guess, that I didn't really think of <laughs> is that... Since we're doing less fine meals than we are simple, we're going to be cooking more often because there's not as big of a gap. Same with the lavish. Maybe I should just keep more. I'm just going to make the gap bigger for them. Not necessarily actually make more on the low end, but... uh. 
more of a gap in between when we start making them and stop making them. Yeah, we'll keep like 42 of those around and like 35 of those around. I changed my mind. Keep like, there we go. <laughs> Something like that. Because it's not the end of the world if we run out of the nice meals, right? Because people can still just eat basic food. But I don't want to get stuck cooking fancy meals 24-7, dude. That would be super annoying. Nate already doesn't have enough time to do everything he needs to do in a day. Alright, how's the temperature doing? Uh, okay, yeah, it looks like one heater's not going to be enough. Which, I mean, I shouldn't be surprised by, but I was hoping it would be. Um... Okay, it is freezing outside. And this is still almost 70, so that's good enough. I was going to say, the freezer shouldn't be having any trouble then. And this room is right on 70. That's perfect, so we can keep growing our corn throughout the winter this year. Oh, dude, we got the poker table working. Very nice. Happy to see that. It's a little bit more variety of stuff that people can do. People like variety. Hey, Mr. Noodle. Are you busy, my love? If you are, don't worry about it. But if you're not, I could really use a drinky drink. <laughs> Your boy is thirsty. What are you doing in game, Mr. Noodle? Refilling wash tub. Let's follow you around a little bit. Refueling wood fired generator. That's something to do. Actually, you know who I'm. Oh, he's sleeping. I was say, I'm actually curious about what Optijack's doing because I want uh, I want these walls to get put up, but he be sleeping, so no point in following him around. Eating a fine meal. People should be getting buffs. The door's locked, by the way, if you do come up, Noodle. The door's locked. Um, shoot, I completely forget what I was saying now. Oh, well. Probably wasn't important, right? Okay, so he is working on... Thank you, love. He is working on building things. He's just got to cut down trees that are in the way. I wonder... No, I guess he's not. I was going to say, it seems like he might be cutting down all the trees first and then working on the building, but... Oh, he might have, actually. That one might have just grown or now or something. Hungry pen animals. It was only a matter of time until stuff started starving. So in that case, what we do, we just got to deconstruct this here. And then that'll let them eat some hay. We have a ton of hay. So that's fine. Have at it, my guys. Uh, that'll get some stuff out of our stock room. It's probably not going to last for long. Because it seems like animals will prioritize hay over the outdoor stuff. Uh, I don't know. I guess it just tastes better or something. I don't really know. <laughs> there you go. We still have 1,500 of it, so that's still a fair amount. And we have a tiny bit that we still grow. We have so much food now that maybe we should take... What do you grow? Rice? Yeah. We're going to switch this from rice to hay grass for the next growing season. God, see, that stack of 400s already, like, gone, dude. At some point, somebody will get around to, uh, to going out there and filling it more. But at least none of our pet animals should be starving now. We're going to have to cut back on the amount of chickens and turkeys we have, aren't we? <laughs> I like having them all. Look at them. They're so cute. But there's just too many of them out here, man. There's way too many. We're going to get less now during the uh, winter months because we don't have this uh, animal pen heated. So they are going to freeze, the eggs are. Um, hmm. Where 
Where's our, uh, not hunting. Oh, the sheep. Current turkeys. Six adults, 10 and 10. Man, yeah, I guess. I, see, my thing was, the reason why I had it set too high is because I wanted as many of them to grow up as possible before we off them so that we got more meat out of them that way. But I think I'm going to have to cut back on numbers, man. It's just it's just entirely too many. We're going to do five and five. Both the chicks and the, uh, the turkeys. And that's going to have to be okay. A manhunter pack. Oh, that's a lot actually um okay i'll tell you what there's no beds people might freak out too bad we don't have those walls up huh zone manage area new area safety Safe zone. Here. I don't think it would do anything having it there on the air conditioner, so let's do that. Uh, it's gonna be a lot of people in there. Kinda wish I had this blocked off here. I mean, they could probably run back and forth without getting into too much trouble. I just hope they don't, like, decide to just chill outside here. Hopefully if I, like, do that. Hopefully they won't just chill out there. Oh, shit. Uh, assign. No, schedule. Everybody go to safety. And stay in there. Mr. Noodle, what are you doing? Slaughtering gobbles? Why? That is not a safe zone? Oh god, I did not see all the monkeys out here. Wow, they got here quick. Okay, uh, never mind. I guess we're fighting. Uh, draft everyone. Nate, go get a weapon. Everybody except for Nate. Come out here and help Chocobo, dude. It would really suck if Chocobo died. God, don't let Lulu die. <laughs> oh my God, guys, please. Okay, Lulu's fine. Lulu, can I draft you? I can. Stay over here. Everybody else? I can't even see like any of the monkeys, dude. Oh God, Chocobo's down. Oh, the, the monkeys are gonna be the end of us, dude. <laughs> uh, Search and destroy. Okay, Chocobo. No immediate danger. Thank goodness. Okay, he's hurt, but he's not actually dying. Okay. Is everybody fine? Search and destroy. Active. Search and destroy melee. Active. Okay. We must have taken care of them all. That legitimately was kind of scary. But it's fine. Everybody's okay. Lulu, you're going to be in the child zone. Everybody else, go do what you got to do. This monkey, get the hell out of here because that Scaria is going to be terrible, dude. Uh, Allow everything. I, I want to double click on the monkeys. Select similar. Get those out of here. They're going to start stinking up the place. Get rid of all those monkeys, dude. Please and thank you. Lulu, the child, the baby, has developed a psychite addiction. Uh, that's good. One second, I have a katana on the porch. Why is your katana on the porch, my guy? Auto needs medical treatment. Okay, just some bruises. Some bruises. Chocobo's a little messed up, but he'll be fine. 
Some bruises. Okay, so nobody's like too bad off, at least. Good. Good, good, good. So, Optijack, about those walls, huh, my guy? <laughs> Bruh, please. I guess it's because I put down all this other stuff, too. Like, the tables and the billiards tables, the fermenting stations. Like, my bad, I guess. But, uh, you're good all the way down to 45 degrees in that case. Let's only set this to, like, 58 that should be warm enough that people don't get debuffs, but not so, like, low that, that they're gonna get debuffs when people come in and out of the, the air conditioner. It'll help the air conditioner, the, the freezer, be more uh, consistent, more cold as well. You keep meaning to put it in the car, need to take it to the garage and fix and sharpen it and such. I guess that's a semi-legitimate reason. Chocobo's starving? He's eating. He's fine. Look at all that corn. Holy shit, dude. We literally do not have space for all this stuff. Okay, it's gonna look dumb. But we are going to stack this room full of shelves. <laughs> like, because <laughs> the shelves can just store so much more stuff. It's gonna look dumb because of how they're literally all pushed up against each other, but it's fine. And honestly, you know what? I'm gonna build a couple more there too. Uh, can I just like, yeah, link settings? Two or more, okay. Link settings. I guess because the other ones weren't built yet. Oh, okay, yeah, seems like Seems like I can now. Link settings. So now, yes, they're all linked together. Good, good, good. Had it since you were eight or nine, really? I don't think I've ever owned a katana, man. Is this just fish? Somebody just dropped a bunch of puffer fish on, on our colony. Weird, but thanks, I guess. I mean, I'm not upset about it. I'm not, I'll take some free puffer fish. I just hope our uh, cook prepares it well enough that, you know, it doesn't get us killed. Marriage is on. Otto proposed marriage to Nate. Nate agreed, and the two are now engaged. Some point in the coming days or quadrums, they will have their marriage ceremony and invite all the colonists. Congrats, guys. Does that mean we're going to be getting more babies around? Half dwarves, half humans? Optijack's failing while constructing stuff. Surprise, surprise. He sucks. I'm joking. That's mean. Man, I really want to get the floor going, too. There's so much stuff I want to do. We just need, like, 20 more colonists. <laughs> so, that, so that we can get it all done. <sighs> but if we get more colonists, that means Nate's going to spend even more time cooking. If Nate's spending even more time cooking, then we're probably going to need either another miner or another cook. Like... Uh, at least we got Lulu that can help out with some stuff now. I think children can use weapons. I would prefer if it doesn't come to that. But I'm pretty sure they actually can, yeah. So... There you go, Lulu. You get a bow when you wake up. <laughs> I hope you like it, my guy. All the sculptures are good. Awesome. Uh, Nate started work on a terror sculpture. Oh, good. Nate got gut worms. Parasitic worms in the gut. They cause vomiting. They also consume the victim's food, which increases hunger. Plus 100%? Bro, that's bad. <laughs> we already, you already eat like seven meals a day. Now, I don't know if that's like plus 100% for a normal person or if that's plus 100% on top of... Oh, no, I, that's on top of what you normally eat. Look at that hunger bar, dude. <laughs> you literally just ate a 
fucking meal and you're already at six five percent food well nate's gonna starve to death <laughs> because of some parasitic gut worms man hungry pen animals yeah about that we still have hay do i not have this set right storage critical i guess just nobody's got to it yet Oh, god damn it, man. Why can nothing go well? Mad donkeys. <laughs> Three of them. Okay. Draft everybody. We'll undraft Nate because he's going to need to get food and stuff. Lulu, you're just going to stay put, basically. That's my plan for you. Everybody except for Nate and Lulu, though. Honestly, just search and destroy. Just go find them and kill them. Like, I don't want to babysit people. Although, <laughs> it kind of sucks watching Otto shoot Rue in the back, though, at the same time. Oh, God. Was Chocobo shot? Yes. <laughs> Three times. Good job, guys. <laughs> you did it. Uh, okay, well. Uh, hauling squirrel dead. How about you rescue Chocobo, actually? <laughs> Thank you for trying to haul the dead squirrel and all that, but... Rue needs medical treatment? How bad are you off? Oh, you were also shot. <laughs> by the auto pistol, so that means Noodle. Noodle shot their, uh, wife? Husband? What do you... A male, okay. So, husband. Oh, that's right. I was going to grab Lulu. Um, okay, I, I like the idea of you cleaning before you did other stuff, Lulu, but I've changed my mind. Haul and then clean. Corn plant has died from rotting. Oh, the corner ones. I need to just remove those. Hold on. Charlotte doesn't drop things? What? What are you talking about? Charlotte doesn't drop things. I'm confused. Shrink zones. I think that's, yeah. That's the size of that. No point in planting them if they're just going to die all the time anyways. Oh, Lulu. Uh, yeah, you're kind of tired. I get that. That's fine. Prioritize hauling hay. Animals be hungry. Oh, can Lulu only carry like 26 at a time? Well... <laughs> Whatever. The ones that were starving got a little bit of food, at least. This probably isn't going to be enough food for the entire winter for the uh, for the pen animals, but... I mean, we could maybe let them come inside? No. What kind of food do we have too much of? Corn. We actually have a lot of corn. Potatoes, rice... I'm just wondering, like, if we just make a stockpile out, he out here of, like, corn temporarily as well. Just, uh, right here, because, I don't know. Storage, clear all, critical priority, corn. rotten although when that kind of food rots it disappears so it doesn't really matter but because i'm pretty sure a lot of these animals will eat corn. a lot of it too is from the muffalo we might have to kill the muffalo just because we don't have the space to take care of it the other option is just to keep making the pen bigger Preemptively, I'm going to. Why well, not? I'm going to wait for the wall to go up. I was going to say preemptively, I'm going to 
extend the fence over here because once this wall's up that can act as a fence so we could actually like run the fence from here straight up and then here straight over and then have this whole area be our fence for the animals um i just realized also we're gonna need a wall there because that's all gonna get mined out eventually Oh, and over here, actually. Son of a bitch, dude. We need a lot of walls. <laughs> Build, copy. Uh... Imperial shuttle crash. Go away. <laughs> we can hardly take care of ourselves, man. We can't deal with your problems, too. <laughs> Are our rooms nice and warm? This one's not. This one is cold, but livable. This one's staying warm enough to grow food in. Yeah, so we should be good. Winter has officially begun. Optijack is really sh struggling to build this billiards table. I'm going to turn it off for a little bit. So that hopefully... Uh, he stops wasting so much time on it. Where's Chocobo's weapon? Did he... Where did he go down at? He went down over here earlier. But he got back up after that. Allowed two things across the map. That doesn't help me, though. Uh... Shoot, dude. I don't remember where Chocobo's weapon is. Tell you what. Zone, shrink. Like this whole corner here. Stockpile zone. Storage. Critical. Clear all. It's only gonna be weapons. Make it easier to find them, at least. Oh, shit. That mad raccoon. Uh, Everybody who has a weapon. Draft and... Go find that raccoon and kill it. Okay, nobody's finding it. Here you go. I'll help. <laughs> I don't know why they weren't hunting it down when I turned on search and destroy, but whatever. There we go. GG. Undraft. Uh, you're not sick, so you can be eaten. You opened a pack of cheese and the little plastic strip fell out of the trash can. And she just went trotting away with it and sped up when you started yelling at her and chasing her. I'm not even a little bit surprised. Not even a little bit. She's a menace, dude. I keep telling you this. You just, <laughs> you just don't believe me for some reason. Nate's probably spending too much time eating to actually do any mining or cooking. Doesn't explain Otto, though. What Otto's been doing. Probably too busy murdering animals. <laughs> oh, there we go. Now that we got him murdered, though, look at that, dude. That's... Oh, there's a bunch of them in here. Well... Mm. I'm sorry, Muffalo. We'll maybe keep you in the future, but... Right now, you just eat too much damn food, dude. God, we got so much meat. Mostly chicken and turkey, but we do have a fair bit of... Well, these are the animals that have been attacking us. <laughs> these are the animals that we grew specifically for food and stuff like that. These are the random mad animals that have tried to kill us. So... What you doing, Chocobo? Hauling? That's fine. I would actually kind of prefer, though... Well, it's fine. Is Lulu feeding the animals? She is. Good little Lulu. Be nice to get a crematorium up and running so that we could clean up this mess at some point. But right now, I, I, I want to focus on the walls. Before we do any other building projects or anything, I just want to get these damn walls working, man. Do 
you still have the gut worms? You do. Gross. How long does that last, man? Too long. That's the answer. Uh, okay, one other thing I want to do. As much as I love having this growing zone out here, I'm going to shrink down this much of it and instead put in a, uh, not potatoes, psychite. Or psychoid, because we have people that are addicted to that. So psychoid there, and on this other side, we're going to do the same thing with smoke leaf. So we have at least a, a token amount of it, right? Like, not much of it, but at least some of both. Uh, expand zone. No, what? Shrink zone. Growing zone from here. There we go. And then you will be smoke leaf. For our addicts that we have. Really wish it was easier to just look at one at a time. Okay, you're doing smoke leaf. Corn. There we go. Psychoid. Okay, good. Set zones to uh, critical for these ones. These are our most important ones. And set zones to smart. Tremendous rude. Relaxing socially? You don't have time to relax socially, Nate. <laughs> Not when you eat 14 meals a day, and you're also our cook and our miner. <laughs> you literally just don't have time for it, my guy. Cargo pods? Uh, where did they land at? Because I was following someone and I forgot to unfollow them first. We couldn't jump to it. That's the one thing I don't like about the follow mod. Where? Just trying to find some like random junk on the ground. Is this it? That's puffer fish. I think that's just puffer fish that we never hauled from earlier. Huh. I don't know. Whatever. Just allowed one thing on the map. Whatever the hell that was just completely overloading me huh no the problem is you eat 14 meals a day <laughs> that's the problem <laughs> oh a bunch of smoke leaf i mean yeah whatever bring it inside man we'll take it okay how's our corn doing now we still have 1100 corn is anything eating the corn Oh, we got an Aurora. Those are pretty. Those will help people have uh, good moods. Wake up, animals. Are any of you eating the corn? I mean, the nutrition stockpile is 27.5. So I'm assuming a lot of that's coming from the corn. Nutrition growth is very low right now because of winter. It's still technically not high enough for the amount of animals we have though which is very annoying wish there was something we can do about that but not really not until these walls get put up we're gonna follow optijack today whenever he eventually wakes up to make sure he's actually constructing. We do have wood, right? Uh, not much. Is managing not being done? Optijack is set to, to manage. Okay, so he should manage and then build a little bit of stuff and then Chocobo or someone should cut it down and then that will allow Optijack to build more of the walls. Maybe we just need to flag more wood to be cut in a day. The wet food's gone? That sucks. 
Uh, we'll get more eventually. Target is only 125. Or no. Target was 500 something. Yeah, okay. Leave it at that. That's fine. Uh, allow logging anywhere. It's weird that we only have like a hundred something set to be done. Whenever we have a target of 500, like there's definitely more wood. There's got to be more fully grown trees. Look at how many trees are on this damn map. Like, you can't tell me there's not more fully grown trees, man. Yes, build the walls. All the walls, please. Nice. I'm so tempted to put Chocobo on building stuff. Like, what's he doing in a day? Consuming meat, or f food. Harvesting trees. That's important, especially right now. Like, we need the wood. And then hauling. I mean, hauling's also pretty important, man. To be fair. Uh, there's just never enough time in a day. Did we get all the shelves put up? We did. We're gonna end up needing more shelves, man still like yeah he's putting stuff on the ground look at that my god dude you know what i'm gonna do it's cheating but here's what i'm gonna do i'm gonna go to options here i'm gonna go to mod options and then i'm gonna go to uh qrs stack double xl and <laughs> i'm gonna take this and just bump it up <laughs> raw food Double XL. Meat, double XL. I don't want giant storage rooms, okay? Just everything. Double XL stacks, man. Other single? Double XL it. <laughs> Let everything stack. Well, okay, not the single stack stuff. That might actually cause problems. No change on that. Close. Okay. There we go. That should fix our storage problems, probably. That basically just gave us, well, I don't know an exact number, but a lot of extra storage space, in theory. As long as the mod's working, which I guess I don't actually know that it is, but I think it is. I'm assuming it is. Oh, it looks like chickens are eating the corn. Good. Because we have a lot, so... <laughs> Eat away, my, my pretties. Eat the corn. Have at it. I guess what I could do is the same sort of thing here where we have wooden fence like that. And then does this have the same settings at least? No. Lame. Okay. Well, that's fine. That's easy to fix. Copy. Uh, paste. Delete this one. Made this too big. Cancel. 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 There we go. Now the real question is, is that mod working? Or maybe it was already set. The ones that I was worried about, maybe they already had set to the double XL. I know one or two of them were, but I'm not sure which ones. 10. 5. Default 20x? Wait, what? Default 10x? Dude. Holy crap. <laughs> the default's a lot higher than I had it. And again, though, it's cheating. I don't care. 
double XLify everything. There we go. Still looks like the max stack he just did was 150, though. Oh, no, okay, he is definitely condensing some things. I don't know if that already needed done, and it was just coincidence that he's doing it now, after we uh, set everything to be bumped up the way it was, or if the bump actually worked this time, but... Yeah, he's still only doing 150 in a stack of corn, though. I don't know, man. That mod might be broke. I mean, there are some errors in the game. I definitely need to try and remember to uh, verify integrity of all the files here whenever we get off shortly. So we got all that food out in the field there, too. Oh, boy. What's our hay looking like? Oh, God. We're out of Psychite. We still have 42 at least. Hopefully uh, the Psychite gets grown soon. Because people are going to want that for their addictions. If they don't have that, they're going to be mighty unhappy. Optijack's just spending too much time doing uh, colony management. I mean, the wall is going up. It's just going up more slowly than I would like. He's not the world's best builder either, so I mean, that's probably part of it. I mean, it's going up. He's botching a lot of stuff, but whatever. It's not the end of the world either way, right? So we lose a little bit of wood every now and then, like, whatever, dude. Wood is a basically infinitely recyclable resource in this game. Like, it's fun. Your ice cream cone is broken in your set. I'm sorry, love. I wish your ice cream cone wasn't broken, but hey, 10 bits. Holy shit. Thank you so much, Mr. Noodle. I appreciate you, love. Object sleeping? Boring. That's why I like following Chocobo. He doesn't necessarily have any of the most interesting jobs, but at least he's always doing stuff. Do I have something else that's stopping Stack Double XL from working? Like. Stack Double XL? Hmm. I don't know, man. <laughs> 36 more. <laughs> Love you, weirdo. Why? Oh, something else we should do, though. Uh, Zone. Build roof. Just like we did this one, we should build a roof there so that the uh, stuff doesn't deteriorate as quickly. I'm going to assume that it's a problem with, like, just the game being a bit broken right now. It's the only thing I can think of. With stack double XL not working. At least if it comes down to it, though, we have enough popcorn to feed us for a couple years. <laughs> At least until our, uh... Why is there still corn growing here? And potatoes. Hey, thank you so much, Noodle, for... Oh, wait, you're breeding. I don't know <laughs> what I thought that sound was. Uh... Okay, you know what? 
I think we need to do... Oh, there we go. Bo's looking cute now. I like that look. I think because of how I have the mod set to do things in a smart way, I think it won't plant the new plants because these old ones are growing in here. Maybe. That's a well-balanced diet. Yeah, corn. That's all you need. Grow four. Critical priority. Psychoid. Smoke leaf. Why are you not growing it? I mean, I know it's too cold outside to grow stuff, but like... I can't tell him to grow it either, which is weird. Ch Chocobo is a planter, right? Grow. Chocobo. What about Rue? No, just cleaning dirt. Sell plants so long as its predicted growth will reach the minimum harvest threshold before it is expected to die from cold or toxin. You know what? Maybe because... Set zones to force. Maybe it's ignoring them because of how cold it is outside. Yeah, and since we're planting it in the ground, they think that it's going to die before they get grown. But in reality, we know we have heaters and stuff keeping it warm in here, a sunlight lighting them up so it's fine okay so that was a a mod problem kind of not really a problem but yeah i wish i'd realized that sooner though because we're running awfully low on cycloid we actually have way more smoke leaf than we need i'm gonna i'm gonna change this even more Five and four, okay. Four and five. I hate when you do that. Shrink zone, five. Growing zone. There we go. So this one, set them all to critical. Set all to force, okay. This one can be, I'm thinking hops maybe. We don't even have our beer industry growing or going. Do we just do a token amount of, heat of hay grass? Like, is that even worth it? I don't know if that's even worth it, to be honest. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, hops. And then you, I want to be a little bit of heel root going all the time. And then we'll have some whatchamacallit growing all the time, too. Smoke leaf. And then mostly corn, though, because, yeah. Corn is the least amount of work, poor nutrition. It takes a long time to grow, so it's not good to, like, start your colony with. But once it's going, it's, yeah, it's good. It's good stuff. Something else you can do. I'd need to put up pillars, which is kind of annoying. Maybe it's something we'll try once the walls are up. Oh, no, because if we put... I was going to say, if you roof off an area with a uh, steam geyser, you can actually warm up an area. Even if it's outside, you can warm it up to some degree. So I was thinking that would help things grow in the winter. But I guess if you block the sun, you're not going to get too much stuff growing, are you? So never mind. I take it back. Medical treatment needed, Nate. Oh, probably for your stupid gut worms. Does it say how long they last? It doesn't. Just It's just painful and makes you hungry. 
That's all it tells us. Good stuff. A heist? Dude, I haven't done a heist in a while. Oh, shit. Uh, I didn't get to pick an amount, so <laughs> I don't know how much it's going <laughs> to join me. Oh, you did the same thing, Nate. <laughs> We're already in it, so I don't think we can pick how much we put in it now. Oh, boy. Oh, well. Also, uh, since if you're not playing Pokemon TCG right now, or if you're playing a different game right now, uh, you might want to write this down because I'm going to throw it away after I send it. So if nobody grabs it in stream and you see this in the VOD, then give it a try. Uh, uh, oh. I think that's right. QWZ, KJ, LK, JDY, L77, or L7L. L7L, yeah, there we go. Good stuff. I have a code card, guys. I'm hoping to at least get this part of the wall done before we end the stream today so I can make the pen a little bit bigger. I don't want to go too much longer, though, because The Last of Us, the new episode, came out today, and I gotta admit, I'm pretty excited to give it a watch, man. You're going to bed. Well... Oh. Oh. <laughs> Pregnancy failed. That sucks. Your baby was too special to be born. Sorry to tell you, Mr. Noodle. I didn't actually know that was a problem. I thought the game would just force it under. I didn't realize that a, uh, a baby could actually... Cockerel 41? Anyways... I didn't realize that they could actually fail because of that. Oh, what? <laughs> I actually joined the heist with no points. So I got no points in return even though I lived. Well, that sucks. I mean, I'm happy I lived, but... Bruh. <laughs> Lame. No, oh, well. It is what it is. I wonder... So Nate is a female... Auto is male. Okay, I wonder if they wind up having a kid anytime soon. I really wish Auto would convert to our religion already, though. Has fallen from 98% to 98%. Good job. <laughs> that was, a, that was did a good job convincing him to convert there, my guy. All right, Nate, when you get up, I'm going to force you to do some mining. Because as much as I want Optijack to finish the walls, we also really need to get a couple more heaters. I guess it's not actually that bad. It's not freezing, at least, in the bedrooms. Eh, whatever. We'll let it go naturally. It'll get there eventually. How's everyone's moods doing? Tainted Parka. Really? Are we not making clothes? We not have jobs set up in the Taylor bench. Oh, no, we do. We have a parka. Do I not have you guys set up to take off? Tainted clothes? Yeah, take off tainted clothes, dude. Like, if it's tainted, go put something else on. Oh, speak of the devil, Nate is pregnant. Look at that, dude. Uh, can we see what kind of baby you're having already? Pregnant first trimester. I hope it goes well with the gut worms. Okay. Happy, heavy jaw, human nose, strong crafting. Nice. We need another crafter. Slate gray skin, dark brown hair, robust. Also nice. Psychically deaf. Meh. Mid black hair, elongated fingers, cold tolerant. Human voice, heavy brow, dark vision, and skin color. Hopefully, that's not over. Metabolic efficiency minus five. That might be another failed pregnancy. That's going to be a problem with our super complex people that we have. Hey, Mr. Noodle's pregnant again, too. Back to back, dude. Poor social, standard body, long haired, strong stomach, dark vision, pointed ear, sleepy, poor shooting. 
Ugh, more complex, but the same metabolic efficiency. Um, I don't know, man. These are both looking a little iffy. And we're still maxing out at stacks of 150. I hope that mod gets fixed whenever I uh, redo everything. Optijack, aren't you a night owl? Thoughts eight with an awful bedroom, really? Hmm. Happy youngsters that makes you happy. That's nice. I thought you were a night owl. I guess not. Who, who's our night owls? Mr. Noodle and yeah, Optijack. So why are you sleeping now? Oh, it's an eclipse. Okay, that explains it. We are in the middle of the day. It's just really freaking dark out. That's all. I'm surprised none of these eggs or like all of these eggs are still fine. These ones aren't, but all of these other ones are still okay. Oh no, ruined by temperature. Okay. Oh wait. Are all of our mods broken? <laughs> I just realized these should have automatically stopped being fertilized. Yeah, there must have been a couple mods that broke. That's annoying. Huh. Ha ha ha. That sucks. At least, like, Dub's Bad Hygiene didn't break. That would have been really bad. <laughs> He pulled a Pikachu V. Very nice, man. Nate needs another medical treatment. Still got those gut worms, huh? Malnutrition. Yep, that happens with gut worms. Okay, child. I know we had you on haul first, but I've changed my mind. Go back to cleaning. This place is disgusting. <laughs> it is bad, dude. Look at all the blood and shit. Our kitchen's gross. It's covered in vomit. Like Chocobo playing hoopstone? Come clean. That's just asking for food poisoning, dude. No we'll let Lulu deal with the rest. <laughs> Drinking Cytite tea, the child. There we go. I mean, we haven't gotten too many messages about people getting sick from food poisoning. I know we have gotten some, though. Having all this dirty ground people are walking around all the time isn't helping. We need to get the rest of our flooring up, but it's really hard to do that when we have so much building being done. Okay, this side is done. We can go ahead and open this side up. Uh, Well, we could if we had any wood, which apparently we don't. <laughs> I'm just going to force cut a bunch of stuff. Orders. Uh, isn't there a way to like? I mean, I guess they're select similar. You can do like that. Oh, harvest fully grown. There we go. Well, that wasn't that many of them, was it? Okay, you know what? Just chop wood then. Cut most of them down. Uh, isn't that just a job we can do too? It is. There we go. This is gonna be a shit ton of wood, but Basically, if it's in our home zone and it's relatively grown, cut it down. Do you have a trader? You do. Optijack. Trade. 
Please and thank you. Oh, it's a royal tribute collector. Never mind. Uh, build these walls first. Damn you. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Because now I don't mind doing the wooden fences. Like that. I'm not going to make it a priority or anything, but whenever they get around to it. Oh. Oh, good. <laughs> a ship with mechs inside of it. This might be the end of the colony. <laughs> Son of a bitch, dude. Okay. Uh, I take it back. Don't build the fence right now. We need to get our kill box up. Because we're going to go piss these guys off. And when we do, we're probably just going to run the hell away. The question is, who's our sacrificial lamb? Probably Otto. And Chocobo? Uh, equip your jade knife. So that we have that. Damn it, dude. Our research is coming along. But we still don't have the calm, sh the, the calm ship. Which is like, uh, equip my mech. I can't equip your mech. <laughs> I wish I could, but we have to kill these mechs to get your mechs. Your mechs won't be able to fight anyways. They're just for uh, building and cooking and hauling and stuff, sadly. Polluted terrain. Yes, I know. We're going to get pollution now. Uh, why don't you guys just burn? <laughs> be nice if the fire just spread to them. Nine tiles a day? Oh, God. And it's relatively close to our base, so we're going to have to deal with it soon. That really sucks, man. <laughs> At least our walls are almost done. We just have this one section left. And our kill box. Da, 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 da. I really hope this isn't the end of the colony, but it might be. <laughs> I mean, these guys have nice weapons. Hold on. We're going to do a save in case this goes horribly wrong, because we need to finish the stream up anyways. Neo Ruse 5. I'm going to grab Otto as our sacrificial lamb. I mean, hopefully he doesn't die, but if anyone does, I'd prefer it to be him. Or her, whatever. And I'm going to have you... Come over here. Because so what I'm hoping is, why all these royal tribute collect... No, don't leave! Run away, Otto! Otto, run! Get them down to here before they... Before they leave, leave. Bro, that was some bad timing. No, they're off the map! Oh, God. And they're catching up. Auto's done for. All right. Uh, draft. Auto's so screwed. Auto, keep running if you can. Thank God that dude's aim seems to suck. Okay. Where's everybody else at? God, they're slow. Get over here. <laughs> uh, Otto, you're going to end up shooting Rue, and I'd really prefer if you didn't. Wolverines. <laughs> Maybe this is the trick. We just take them down one at a time. Okay, Rue, how you doing? Death in 24 hours. You know what? Undraft you. Grab everyone else, though, except for... Except for Rue. Come up this way. 
Oh shit, they're coming. Oh shit, you have a gun. <laughs> you have a good gun. Okay, no immediate danger. That's good. Uh. Okay, make him come around to us. Or maybe we can sneak around. Yes. Okay, uh, Meleers? Not Rue, Rue's out right now. Get you guys to come over this way. Optijack, Mr. Noodle. Get you two over here. Otto, you're good where you're at. Oh God. <laughs> Jack got shot and killed. <laughs> oh, God. There goes Otto. <laughs> well, <laughs> their head was shot off. <laughs> and Optijack's liver was shot off. Oh, God, dude. Okay. But once you get close, they don't really have anything they can do. So this guy specifically is the one, <laughs> is the one we're going to need to be careful with. Reeds? <laughs> Uh, hmm. Yeah, too bad we don't have any, like, people with Wolverine's ability. Uh, from the Marvel Universe. Well, okay. We know what to do next time. These little guys, not good, but not that bad either. This guy with the shotgun, we need to worry about him. Because he's gonna wreck our shit. What gun are you using? Well, none now, because you're dead, but... Also, the fire put itself out. For, I mean, it's not completely out. It's still spreading. Alright, we're not gonna save that. We're gonna, we're gonna pretend that never happened. It was a learning experience for next time. <laughs> Anyways, guys, it is getting late. I'm gonna go to bed... Thank you all so much for coming and hanging out with me for a little bit, though. Next time, uh, hopefully that goes a little bit better. Oh, now there's a squirrel angry. This is going well. Oh, Nate's down. Nobody's going to help him, though. He caught himself back up. Whatever. This is all alt history anyways. <laughs> Have a good night, everyone. I'll be back in a couple days for some... On what, Sunday? Yeah, Sunday to play some PS2 stuff. See you guys then. Have a good night, and as always, be kind to each other, y'all. Bye-bye.